Oh shit, the cat. Understood. In theory, it could be. In practice, that would be stupid. Imagine if it was a trap and Inukai just got mauled at the end. Hey, you've deemed an Ash Aragami, and then he just fucking dies. That'd be the world's fastest ending ever. Now. Nah. Yeah. Holy shit. This is what I call an exterminatus mission. You know, we'll be fine. That's fine. Ah, oh, well, that thing's far enough away. Again, we'll be fine. It's working. Stop struggling. See? We're fine. Oh, you son of a bitch. Understood. You son of a bitch! Ricardo! But I'm not done yet.
Triple wow. Time to strike. Sit down. Uh, I thought I could block it. <laughs> That's it. Fire! Doing heroin. Ricardo. Blessed by the humanoid Aragami. 
Oh wait, that's a waterfall. I have heard enough of your crude language, Dr. Inukai. You will be picked up soon. Uh-oh. Well, he's... Is this the Governor General? Who do you think I am? What is the meaning of this? Let go of me! Well, he's fucked. What is that all about? Good. Well deserved. Two, three, and... Heh <laughs> nice freeze frame. Mm. <laughs> no, I would like to lose my progress. <sighs> I wonder if I'm actually good at this game or not. Unseemly, Inukai. We received the news of your support for the Crimson Queen from your own forked tongue. On this very vessel. What? What are you doing here, Governor General? <laughs> Send Dr. Inukai to Mission HQ. Let go of me! Hands off! Without me, Gleipnir's technology will fall 20 years behind. Do you want that, Governor General? Accept your punishment, Inukai. Uh, Let go! Get off of me! <coughs> Did we play our role well enough? You mean, you were just trying to sniff out a traitor? My deepest apologies for endangering you. You will be awarded with appropriate compensation. So this was all planned out from the moment we left Mission HQ. Smart. Come on, Hilda. You gotta tell us this stuff. I'm sorry for keeping this from all of you. I had to keep the plan a secret to protect the Governor General. Uh, I should have known that Inukai would have never let Feem go free. We had to help out in order to avoid future... problems. Yeah, what he said. You have done us a great service. Your skills are most remarkable. Wait, there's Thank more of us? Hilda. My escort should arrive soon. I'm sorry, I wasn't able to provide better quarters. To the contrary. Being in a place like this suits me better than a stifling meeting room. Stay with us. Can I have your coat, by the way? Please, take good care of Hilda for me. We will. That's either his I daughter or something. I understand that you ages have a great burden to bear. However, in order that humanity might survive these desolate times, I'm afraid it is unavoidable. I beg your assistance in this. Can I get more spears? I must go until we meet again. I'll walk with you. Hey, Hilda. Can we talk about Werner at some point? Sure. Let's talk once I get back. Oh, that's gonna go well. So, you and Werner were students in the same lab, is that it? Yes. He was a gifted researcher. Everyone had their eyes on him. He was intelligent, hardworking, and genuine. Those traits attracted me. The world was still being ravaged by Aragami, but for us, they were tranquil days. Oh. I had faith that we'd be side by side like that forever. Damn, that piano's going hard. Shit. Until the 
day came. Mm -hmm. It's a calamity. Mm -hmm. That's right. Everything changed on that day. My life. And his, too. I understand. I didn't mean to keep this from you. Everyone has a secret or two. That's only natural. One other thing. What's your relation to the Governor General? It's something I noticed before. You two seem to go a long way back. Mm -hmm. That's because... Werner is the Governor General's son. Oh. Huh? So this is all a father-son quarrel? Everyone in the area who survived the calamity owes it to the Governor General and Gleipnir. But there were many sacrifices as well. That includes the existence of ages. Werner could never accept those sacrifices. He threw himself into the fray to protect the weak who were written off by Gleipnir. And then he formed the Crimson Queen. Yes. But I wonder if there wasn't a way to stop him. If I had been braver, like all of you, maybe things could have been different. If I could stand up to the world's despair. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. You should listen, Hilda. You really did fight in your own way. Mm -hmm. Your port is a paradise. And this ship... I like the ship. You've got ages, regular god-eaters, and a mess of kids. Everyone does what they can and helps open the door to a new tomorrow. And Ricardo's there. We might not be related, but we're a family. <laughs> All of that is here now because you never gave up. You kept fighting. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. You're both right. We need to look toward the future, not the past. Let's head on home, Hilda. We don't want to get surrounded by Aragami again. Right. Let's go home. Everyone, to your stations. This vessel is returning to Mission HQ. I don't even... Oh, I mean, okay then. I didn't kill anyone yet. Child. Oh. oh, well, there goes the theory of them being related. Excuse me, Fiend. <laughs> Just shoved her out of the way. <laughs> Oh yeah, Lulu. Just check out the fellows in the lab quick.
<laughs> oh, of course. 